Hello everyone, I'm Chan Chung Math, and this is the summary video of adding in integers. Um, remember the integers are the whole numbers and their opposites. Uh, an important um, term that we'll be using in this video is absolute value, and that's the distance a value or a number is from zero. The absolute value of 36 is 36 because 36 is 36 units from zero. The absolute value of negative 74 is 74 because it's 74 units away from zero, and so on. Okay, so if you are adding two integers, or two numbers for that sake, um, these are the four possibilities. Both of them are positive, both of them are negative, one is negative and one is positive, and the positive value is further from zero than the negative value. That is, the positive value has a greater absolute value than the negative value. Or adding up positive and negative, or you could say negative and positive. And the negative value is further from zero than the positive value. Okay, so what's happening in each of these cases? Well, here we have hot air and hot air. So the balloon's going to go up, and it's going to go up even more. So how much does it go up? Well, we add the two absolute values. We add the two distances from zero. And so this is, it's going to go up 36 and then 28 more. So it's going to go up a total of 64. So the value is going to be positive 64. In this case, we have sandbags and sandbags. This will make the balloon go down 15. This will make the balloon go down 74, so it's going to go down 15, and then 74 more. So we add the absolute values. We add how far each number is from zero. So the balloon's going to go down 15, and then 74 more for a total of 89. So it's going to end up at negative 89. In this case, we are putting sandbags together with hot airs. So, this will make the balloon go down, this will make the balloon go up, and it's going to go up more than it is going to go down, so it's going to end up in the positive. It's going to go down 43 and up 65, so it's going to end up above zero. So, how much above zero? Well, here, we subtract the absolute values, and we want to put the number that's further from zero that has the greater absolute value on top. And so this balloon's going to go up 22 more than it's going down, so it's going to end up above zero at positive 22. Remember, when writing a positive number, it's not necessary to write the positive sign. Um, and in this case, the hot airs make the balloon go up, sandbags make it go down. It's going to be going down more than it's going up. So it goes up 54 and then goes down 81. So I know it's going to be ending up below zero somewhere. So the value is going to be negative. How much below zero? Well, how much more does it go up? Or how much more does it go down than up? Remember, we are putting the number that's further from zero on top. So you see trade of 10, so 10 ones, and then, so it's going to be going down 27 more than it's going up, so it's going to end up 27 below zero at negative 27. So uh, what's the idea here? Well here we see the signs are the same. We have both hot airs or both sandbags, so we add the absolute values, we add the distances from zero, and then if they're both positive, the result will be positive. If they're both negative, the, result, uh, the sum will be negative. In these two cases, we're adding a negative and a positive, a negative and a positive. The order doesn't matter in addition. And in this case, since, uh, it's going down and up, 
down and up, we have to think, all right, is it going up more or down more? Um, so since the, the sandbags and hot airs are making the balloon go in different directions, we subtract the distances from zero, we subtract the absolute values, and then we use the sign of the number further from zero, the sign of the number that has the greatest absolute value. So here, uh, this number's further from zero, it's positive, so after we subtract the absolute values, we see the results positive, and here, the number further from zero is negative, so after we subtract the absolute values, uh, we know the sum is going to be negative. Hope you, uh, hope this series of videos helps you understand adding integers better. Um, please click like, subscribe, and uh, leave comments, and thank you for watching. Zai Chandler.